I <laughs> slipped and fell in a puddle, started yeah, drowning. Right here, bro. <laughs> all right, that this is Evans DeGeneres. All right, so the next moment <laughs> is about to be pop decks. No home, Go ahead, yeah. Pretty much, man. I got some questions. We're gonna do it like a magician, but the problem is you gotta be real and honest when you pick these cards. You pick them, I ask you the yeah, question, you answer. Well. So go ahead. That's one. Oh, you ain't get to see it. You just right. told that's, me to pick one. Yeah, yeah, but you don't get to see it, man. We got to get fired up. Okay. Yeah. That's one. We got to get fired up. Okay. Leave it like that? Yeah, pick two. Oh, one. Anywhere go. you go. Boo got to pick some, too. Nah, Boo over there stuck on his own. All right. I picked some. Yeah, well, he's, but, uh, he's had his number. He's had his number. Boo is an elderly guest, y'all. Y'all know yeah, the shit. Boo shit hey, on himself three times so far in the podcast. Just letting that y'all know. That nigga look like an Israelite marshmallow. <laughs> <laughs> Dark Knight Mitchell. Give him a light first, bro. Oh, my God. All right, come one on, One kingdom. Man. One kingdom. <laughs> two, one, five, eight. Shut up, man. Shit. Why do you keep on rehearsing like Black Panther go do another casting call? <laughs> we loved you in uh, Spookabye, baby. <laughs> I think it was a Spookabye, baby. All right, let me get this No, we love Kid Clark. All right, first yeah. one. <laughs> what would be the worst movie sequel ever made? Be impulse. Uh, do the right thing, part two. <laughs> Why would it be the worst thing ever made? Because they made a TV series. And that was trash. And mm. so, if they Did made a movie, that would be trash as well. I missed that. <laughs> It was yeah, right. You missed it. It didn't hit. It did not hit. Yeah, it's it's like it's 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 not like it's Some things should be left a classic. That's what I'm just saying. You said ever made. Spot because here's the thing. Do the right thing was so artistic. But he didn't say remade. He said. He said part two. He said two. He said part two. Right. It shouldn't have been a do the right thing. What would be the worst movie sequel ever made? So. Oh, sequel ever made. Shut the fuck up. You got to go. You over there. Shut your big mama ass looking ass up. Tweety face looking at When his Martin did was. play Big Mama, he looked like you. You look like an elbow. Get your elbow. <laughs> you know what, Mr. I want side, bro? You got a blackhead in your nose. <laughs> Y'all look like Farrakhan and I- Ali Selassie. That's what I'm <laughs> you got Question policy. number two. Go ahead, man. Go ahead, dog. How would someone. You like a black Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> you look like a pimp. <laughs> this nigga look like a pimp. Uh... All day, thank you, my nigga. I feel like a Pepsi. A I'm like a Pepsi. pimp, like he said, a <laughs> pimp. Pepsi. You know what? We got Cat Williams Pepsi. Jr. before he gets into his outfit. <laughs> you, okay. <laughs> Y'all forgot. No, 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 no. no. What I forgot. No, 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 where to hide. All right, question number two. How much would someone have to pay you to eat a live spider? These spiders, I'm black, dog. No so how much thugs, they gonna pay? We no thugs will sing along, <laughs> sing along. No, no thugs, no music. No. Question number three. That Question like number three. Man. It's all about no thugs. You know no what? The backup dance is the one twelve. Get it together. No thugs, no thugs. Come on, backup dance is the one twelve. Get it together. Next is you a chance. Next thing is like Elmer Fudd. Hip hop Elmer Fudd. Yeah. This nigga dressed like Elmer Fudd, ladies and gentlemen. We like you, man. Hip-hop. All right, man. Out of your business. All right, Chuck oh, Dizzle, DJ Head Con down over here. All right, yeah, question number bro. three. What is something you get wrong almost every time you do it besides waking up? Man. What do I get wrong every time Every time I do it? Just trying to talk in public, man. Wiping his like, ass. For me to get it. <laughs> Wiping his ass, he get it wrong. <laughs> You can tell the wife of his ass. Like, ass wrong, dog. <laughs> <laughs> tell the wife of his ass. We got skin mark shouty over here. He <laughs> <laughs> get it wrong. Oh, oh, the wife of his ass. Damn. One thing you wrong. I thought I only needed three swipes. <laughs> I should have had seven. He get it wrong. Did it. All right, baby wipes. 
you know what? If you guys were a band, you ever stop yourself in the middle of the day like, man, I need to wipe again. <laughs> I wasn't done. Excuse me. Ugly problem. Excuse me. Ugly problem. Man, you go out there just don't shit. Just wipe your ass in the bathroom. Like, bro, I need to wipe again. Like, man, I don't want to wipe again. Just wipe your ass in the bathroom. Last week you ain't shit. You just in there wiping. Man. You come out, ain't no, ain't no flush. <laughs> she quiet as fuck. You just wipe. You in there no blocks. Shit. <laughs> some of you niggas have been here for two weeks and shit be still coming out. That's how you get down? Nah, you niggas. Nah, you, I, niggas. I, you know he old. He gotta watch YouTube videos Man. on how to do it. Man. That nigga wipe his ass on his stomach. <laughs> <laughs> How you wipe your you head know, you look like you do stomach. everything for your stomach. You like for your back, change the channel from your stomach. That nigga you know, jack off your plate in his ass in the mirror. Your, you know, <laughs> he said you jack off in the mirror. <laughs> yeah. I got one. I'm Zago. Dude, get away from me, man. <laughs> All right. You know what? Said, I'm Zago. I'm Zago. I'm Zago. I got my next segment. It's called trading places, but you know you probably rather right hey, young. Killing so, you right now. <laughs> you know that's why I'm trading trading places. All right, go ahead, bro. And you know you see the movie Freaky Friday. Yeah, whatever you talk. Oh no, we done with these cards. <laughs> they don't pay us enough to talk more than three questions. Yeah, you guys, you guys, you got some, bro. Go ahead, so, bro. Go ahead, man. Yeah, man. So I have a trading places segment, but you so know you're rather you young, so you may think of Freaky Friday. And the whole idea so, is that we're taking one of those shots two people's lives and we're trading their places and we're going to first ask the question does it work and then we'll talk about how it is if, it, if they did trade places all right so the two people for example i've had donald trump and tupac trade places before and we talked about it that's just one example all right so now my question to you let's get to it da, 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 da. oh you loving it <laughs> so we got bill clinton trading places with snoop dogg Number one, would that work? Can Snoop Dogg be president and can Bill Clinton be a rapper? Hell yeah, you can change places with Bill Clinton. <laughs> I could be the motherfucking president. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 good morning, uh, ladies and gentlemen. This has been your president, a.k.a. Finding Nemo. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> Yeah, Shout out to Snoop Dogg, Uncle Snoop, man. Oh, Goddamn man. right, he should be the motherfucking president. Salute, motherfucker. And Bill Clinton, you goddamn right could get on that motherfucking and, 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 and jump back in with. Uh, and they don't fuck with you. And they don't fuck with you. And they don't fuck with you. What you have to understand is Bill Clinton. The things I haven't killed thinking about. But you know, I've been Clinton, to but that he, he gonna do that in Juice and Jen? No, you, you know it ain't no fun if the homies can't have none. And you know you Bill Clinton know Bill a little something about that. Uh, Bill Clinton so played jazz, he, he played, played saxophone, he melodic. He was the first black president. I'm just saying, he kind of was the first black. But Barack can't go over here and start Barack dancing. Barack wasn't black when he was president. He was white when he was black. being president. He came out, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Um, no, 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 no. Yeah, oh, oh, there's music playing. Oh, 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 oh. I like Jay Z. Oh, 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 they, oh, oh. Man. I like but North Carolina. Bill basketball. Clinton wasn't like that. Bill Clinton was getting his dick sucked. He was smoking yeah, eating uh, chicken. blunt, eating chicken. He was, he was on Justin Arsenio. <laughs> Bill Clinton was on Arsenio uh, wow. two times. <laughs> okay. I think like, Snoop would have been on him like As president. Every week. Bill Clinton was on there as president, yo. Real talk, yo. So you think Bill, Bill Clinton was on Arsenio Hall more than Snoop. Like knocking this. Wow. Think about that. Just put that in your mind real quick. What, what, what's one thing? With the glasses on, have some, and he had some lokes on and oh, played the saxophone and nah. got bitches both times. <laughs> what's one thing that'd be different if, if they did trade places? What's something that'd be significantly different? Bill well, Clinton who? Snoop. Snoop. Okay, that's a good. You go. You can chime on this. No, go ahead. I if it was Bill Clinton and Snoop, and they changed places. What would be different? The the difference would be Bill Clinton and Snoop would be president. So the thing is, Snoop gonna take over. Bill Clinton turned into Snoop. I was gonna do some more <laughs> reading and change the business. <laughs> So you give Snoop. Give me this, bro. No, 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 no. How you got ashes in your drink, huh? No, no, no. <laughs> this is you drinking? You no, know, well, leave Fat Albert alone. Look at this. Right? This is you drinking an ashtray. <laughs> what is you doing, bro? You Smokey Robinson. What are you no, doing? No, 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 no Tito, no. No, no, no Tito. It's not right no. for you. You're not supposed to drink it like this, Tito. No. Don't fall back. No. Don't. 
Look at the man in the mirror. <laughs> no. It's the man in the mirror. Joseph doesn't like it's that. Put no. some Corona. Add some Corona. Nah, this nigga dropped, ladies and gentlemen, this nigga has dumped the blunt in his, in his yak real quick. And he was real niggas. Real niggas. This is the lemonade. This is the lemonade. Ethiopian bourbon right now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this. Man, that nigga got that Jim Jones juice in his wallet. <laughs> he got he man blight in his pocket. Yes, he don't do it. So, hey, Brent, Taylor, Mr. Rose King, what are you most excited for coming up? Because, you know, what's something we could talk about that we could look forward to? I done heard, we actually was in a little story in Phoenix event, so that's, that's a segue. I'm glad you said that, brother. I'm glad you said that. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm excited, man. Too. March 11th. That's coming up, man. This week, this week coming up, man. March 11th, been in Phoenix, Arizona. And I've been in Phoenix going back and forth, like, for the past year. But finally, 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 they've given me my own show at my own spot. At a major, major comedy club at Stand Up Live, it's downtown Phoenix, man. Thank you, man. Appreciate it, brother. Right, I will be having, I will be having Bugatti on my next show. So you're not the first one, bro. You can't come to the first one. Nah, really just, and that's my nigga. And, and he I, can come. Support. Honestly, he can come to the. He, honestly, nah, he might be at the first burn. one though. He I might know. be at the first rest one. Rest in peace, Bird. But rest in peace. My boy Bird, Iceberg, Iceberg Bird. comedian, yeah, just just had a funeral or whatever. So Boo no, won't be making nice. it on the eleven. And unfortunately, I would love to be at the funeral. I Man, I meant to, you know, boom, yeah, boom. No, but you, you work. hey, we got it's, it's business. And Bird it's would never have Bird would have it seen no other way. Yeah, Shout out to Bird by the way. Rest but um, peace, yeah, rest in peace, Bird, man. But um, March eleventh, uh, yeah, I will be in Arizona and Phoenix, Arizona. I got my own show, and I'll be doing like a monthly show at okay. Stand Up Live. Um, so man, come through, pull up, check your boy out, man. You I'll doing be having an eight hour drive, or you doing a forty five minute flight? Um, I'm gonna fly out there, man. You know what I'm saying? That flight low key colder than everything, man. Just go out there, come back, you ain't got to deal with no bullshit. Support, support. Mm. It ain't nothing but thirty minute flight, man. So, so that means man. the only town for the night. But also check this out. If anybody want to come to it and check it out, man, come through and fuck with it. Like y'all can drive out there. It, it's only a four five, like a four and a half years in fees, man. Be honest with you, I might drive out there. All the times that I did do the shows out there, I always I used to drive out there or whatever. It ain't nothing but a cool ass smoke trip out there, B. So Mm. you know what I'm saying? But if you do come, I put it like this, anybody pull up, man, and mention some noise, whatever, man, I give you some Rose King uh merchandise. Y'all can smoke with me, you know what I'm saying? You already know I got big weed on me, whatever. And you know what I'm saying, just chill out, fuck with your boy, man. So um, let me ask you this, bro. Do people ask you because you the roast king? Do they ask you like, can I put a sh- like a note on my partner's shirt so you could roast him, so you could bag on him? I roast on anybody, man. Who but does anyone on? like make the <laughs> subject like he's the object right now? He they holler at you. I get that all the time, man. Uh, I get a lot of people sending requests. Holler at me. Send me a DM if you want, man. Send me a DM. I actually have a service that I do it, man. Um, I have a service that I roast people on. So. Mm. For real, for real, man. Um, you want to talk about your baby daddy, your baby it's $10. mama? $10. Cash him out. Anybody, man. He got real. something It's only $10. That man. was your problem. It's, it's tax season. season. You roast your friend. I do birthdays, weddings, <laughs> bar It's tax mitzvahs, season. You know, some baby daddy season. overspent money. Um, some, some lucky man pimped the chuck. Somebody lady. sick, whatever yeah. it is, be Like, whatever roast. it is. Just this let me know, man. Yeah. 1-800-ROAST-KING. I'll roast the shit out of him, dog. I'll roast the fuck out Hit of him, dog. On purpose, because I want to. From the heart. From the heart. From the heart, too. And let him know they ain't shit. He just as short as hey, Kevin Hart. That's from the heart. Easy and Big Shine. <laughs> You niggas, uh, like, <laughs> they come to niggas' offices just to roast them for ten minutes. I roast the fuck and then out. Leave. <laughs> hey, but you gotta pay for gas. You gotta pay for flight. But no, nah, ten dollars for all roast the fuck out of whoever you want. Man, <laughs> if you want him to come to the office, together. if you want me to show up in person, that's a whole other thing. We can talk about that too. I will show up in person. <laughs> that's the new thing. Me, boo too. Boo too. Me and Boo hey, will show up. So just hey, DM me. Send to my DM, Brent Tyler, comedian Brent Tyler. And uh, yeah, real spit. I promise you, real spit. Me and me and Boo will pull up. 
Roast a nigga in person. We will film it to, and we will film it so you can have a tape and you can see. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the action. Now, would you just walk up to him, just roast him, when you tell him who you are and why they? Nigga, you, you know the fuck I am, that. nigga. I don't need to introduce <laughs> shit, nigga. You see the you shirt? Fuck I am. You see the hoodie? Man, you know the fuck I am when I'm done. I know that part. You know the fuck I am. You never tell me when we done, nigga. I don't need to introduce shit, nigga. He said I ain't got to spit on you, but you gonna be spitting on. That must be the roast king, like you. You're going to get what you need. I promise you, guarantee 100% on your money back. Ain't nobody going to roast. Ain't no, What's the nobody. cash app? What's the cash app? Cash app. Roast me. Cash me up. out. Cash <laughs> me out. Cash app. Comedian Prince DM. Comedian Brent Just Comedian Brent Taylor. DM, Comedian Brent Taylor. Just Comedian Brent Taylor. DM me and I'll send you all the information for the cap app, cash app, whatever. Like I said, though, we're going to be in Phoenix, um, Arizona. He will be there next month. And then also this hey, stuff. Yeah, yeah. And also, this uh, check out all them digital. We got some more shit coming out. Shout out to everybody, all them roast digital me. man. Roast all me, everybody at roast me. Ti, everybody man. Baron Davis, Cedric, everybody man. Uh, Patrick, Kid, Doughboy, everybody man. We doing it. We doing it, y'all. Uh, it's, it's some more shit coming. And Big Taylor, man, yeah. Brent, man. I tell him I said my young guy. He's over. Did I tell you? He's over here with his platform, man. I seen the thing. I said they they got seven thousand, seventy thousand. Well, we moved. What you said, no, you, what you told me, you said, uh, we can do it. And no, was the first one, when he was a kid, I said, look up. I said, and I said, repeat after me. I am, he said, I am somebody. 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 I'm, I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Man, I was trying to have a quote moment. I was trying to have a quote moment. He was fuck your quote. Fuck your quote. Man, but that. shout out to the XFL for um, sponsoring Bugatti and hey, Marlboro man. and all that shit. Y'all man. see the new mascot, right? Hey, y'all get up for Roseanne Barr. He talking about them, but this is odd. God damn. Got an upgrade. Nigga, I told you. All right, uh, all right, check it out. This is your boy Brent Taylor in the middle. Uh, I got my boy Silo. I got my boy Bugatti. Check us out, man. Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Yeah. Um, once again, March 11th, I'm going to be in Phoenix, Arizona at Stand Up Live. Um, link below. Look at the bio. Look at the link. And you can get some tickets right now before they sell out, man. Um, and also got merchandise and everything else. This is my people's right now. Yeah, um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and cut my. You already cut it? Follow me at DJ Wine Dollars. Follow the show Contrast Uncut. Shout out Bobby D Presents. Man, I appreciate y'all for having me at the same time. First Love simulcast man. show. And we did this simul. This is a simulcast, yo. Man, first you know what That's what's up, man. This is by BEG Productions. Got two Blue channels. Blue. We got three channels Blue. producing Blue. this now. <laughs> we got three. What? Uh, what's the. Damn. Um, and we also sponsored by insulin for Bugatti, y'all. Um, <laughs> sign up. <laughs>